brave young men and women of the United States military. The single most capable, competent, bravest, deadliest military to ever have taken the field of battle. These young men and women are ready to take the fight to the enemy, whether the enemy be in the air, on land, on the ocean, underneath the waters, or even in outer space. However, these young men and women need to realize that their rank structure, honestly, is just freaking stupid. Today we're going to cover the officer rank structure for the Army, the Marine Corps and the Air Force as you can see here. These are all the ranks from 2nd Lieutenant all the way to General and in this case General of the Army. The junior enlisted all use bars and why not? Everybody likes a bar. But if you notice, the 2nd Lieutenant has a gold bar while the 1st Lieutenant has a silver bar. Now, if I was to offer you a gold bar or a silver bar of equal size, which would you pick? You would pick the gold. If you really wanted to make silver as much as the gold, you would have to have 90 little bars, and that's not practical for the applications of a uniform. So, first thing we're gonna do is gonna switch the gold and the silver. So there we go, gold and silver are now reversed. Uh, and by the way, the uh, what lack of creativity, we can't come up with another name instead of second. Really? Do we have first captain, second captain, first colonel, second colonel? No, we don't. So in this case, we're going to actually steal something from the Navy and we're going to take their lowest ranking, which is Ensign, and we're going to make the second lieutenant an Ensign. So now we have Ensign, we have Lieutenant, and then we move on to Captain. Now Captain is where we have a problem, because of course, to this guy in the Army, a Captain is an 03 or 2 silver bars. To this guy in the Navy, a Captain is an 06, which is the same as Colonel. It is absolutely freaking stupid that we have two Captains and they're completely different ranks. So, since the Army, the Marine Corps, and the Air Force all three consider Captain to be two silver bars and a Captain, and the Navy is the only one that thinks that a Colonel is a Captain, sorry Navy, you're gonna have to suck it up, you lost this one, from now on, this is Captain. Now once again, initially we have the problem where it's the gold and the silver. The gold is the more precious of the two metals, so obviously right off the bat we're going to have to switch Major and Lieutenant Colonel because that absolutely makes no freaking sense. Now we move on to Colonel. Colonel's not bad. I like Colonel. It's a big eagle. It's holding arrows. Okay, that will strike fear in the heart of the enemy. So okay, we'll keep Colonel the way it is. We're fine with Colonel. The big problem you have with these guys is right there in the middle, Lieutenant Colonel. Now, I get the Colonel part because he's almost a Colonel, he's right next to the Colonel, he's hoping to be a Colonel, in fact, he's, he's willing to do just about anything to make Colonel, uh, but if you notice, he's also next to Major, but it doesn't say Major Colonel, it says Lieutenant Colonel, it doesn't even say Captain Colonel. It says Lieutenant Colonel. You literally demoted him two or three ranks all the way back to Lieutenant to come up with a title in order to call him Lieutenant Colonel, which makes absolutely no sense. This guy should be called Major Colonel, but then that doesn't make any sense because it sounds like he's higher than the Colonel. So we're going to have to come up with an entirely new name for Colonel, for Lieutenant Colonel. So this is the middle management ranks is going to read it. First of all, it's going to be Silver Leaf, Gold Leaf, and then the, and then the Big Eagle with the arrows. And it's gonna be major. This guy's gonna stay colonel. We'll find with that. And then this guy, this guy, we're just gonna call him the big chingon. General grade officers, once you get promoted past colonel, good luck with that, by the way. Uh, you make brigadier general. That's a nice ring to it. I like brigadier general. After that, you make major general. Wow, now you're a general, but you're major. And then you make lieutenant general. What the freak just happened? Explain to me how it's possible that a lieutenant is now higher than a major. Now, you get past lieutenant general and you get your four star. Now you're a general. Just a general. Is something missing here? If I introduce myself as a general and the guy next to me says he's a brigadier general, well, he's not just a general. He's a brigadier on top of the general. Therefore, he must be higher than me. There's something missing here. The guy made four stars. He deserves a proper title, not just general. All of these guys are general. And the biggest pet peeve is right here. This, this is, oh, this is the one that just, oh, just chaps me. Once you get five stars, you become general of the army. Well, what, what else are you supposed to be a general of? General merchandise? 
general disarray, general chaos, general motors. So this is the way the new ranks are going to read for the generals. We're going to take the exact duplicate of the junior enlisted ranks and just apply them to the general ranks. That way we have complete continuity. Ensign general, we're going to go lieutenant general, and then you become a uh, captain general, and then you become a major general. And then once you get five stars, you become the big chin going in charge of everything, general of the army. Yeah.